so everybody gets like a little adrenaline kick out of something. I get an adrenaline kick from being in snowy, foggy mountains with a team of pack horses. More pack horses the better, but not too many because then it gets a bit ridiculous. But nine is quite a lot to be leading over a pass like this. Like it's perfect amount to still be safe, but give you a little bit of a buzz. My name is Blythe and I'm a wrangler at Backcountry BC and Beyond. Being a wrangler means that you take care of the horses. So your day revolves around making sure that the horses are fed, happy and that they're working well. If you want to be a wrangler, you have to really enjoy walking around in the pitch flat by yourself. And I do. I love horses, packing horses in mountains and I read about this vast area where you could ride for months and months and months and not cross a road. I wanted to get out of New Zealand as an awesome place to live but it's pretty small and actually two major things drawing me to Canada were the northern lights and wolves, packing horses, mountains as far as you can see. Like, why wouldn't you want to explore that? Horses actually mean a lot to me in my life because I understand them. They're very calming for me. Everything they do has a reason and everything they do I can figure out what that reason is. Like sometimes if things can get a little bit confusing like people relationships or just life in general, everything can be a little confusing. Like I could be talking to you right now and I might not know what you're thinking or I might not know how you're feeling because people are so hard to read. And if I go into a team of horses and they're so easy to read and I can understand why they're doing what they're doing and our relationship with the horse, even if it kicked me or bit me, like it'd be a reason why and I'd understand why. And to me that's really calming because it's like you're on the same level as something and there's nothing hidden below the surface. I really love my job here. Like I actually spend my year looking forward to coming here and to doing this job. I love the country here, I love the horses, we've got some really awesome horses and I love the crew. Like I love all the people that are working for Dustin, everyone's really supportive of each other. When you finish this job, after three months, you know yourself so much better. Like you know the things that you like to do, you know the things that make you happy and I think it's because you don't have any Thing else to affect it. You're just yourself doing something that you love for that amount of time and everything you know, becomes a little clearer when I get out. Like I sort of know what, what I want to do or what I, what I like to do, what makes me happy. And what was funny is that so they've been getting a little bit stressed that they haven't shot one yet. And I said this morning, it's just luck, but you know, I bet you today that the horses are going to spot the moose. It's thick fog, our senses are numbed, our sound is numbed. We haven't got anything like the senses the horses have. And they're like, oh yeah, 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 the horse is going to spot the moose, I'm sure. They went to spot and call on that and I just sat with the horses. And then old Reggie here is suddenly like, and I was like, there's a mouse. So I snuck through the trees, had a look, there's a big bull mouse. So I went back and I was like, oh guys, guess what? There's a big bull mouse and the horses just spotted it. <laughs>